if you can see that here at this 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 corner we have the algorithm okay and here we have the uh, actions that is that is there in the slide so i have put it the action and the algorithm here so we can refer it whenever it is required now uh, i'll put here the initial state and the goal state so all of you pay attention it is very important uh, to understand this at 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 a one go so that uh, you will be more familiar with that and goal is tech planning now here if you'll see we have what is the initial state here is i'm just drawing it now here we have boxes a b and here we have boxes c and d okay now this is my initial state now what is my goal state let's draw it so the goal state will be like this we have a box c we have a box d we have a box b and we have a box a so you can understand that this is my initial state and i have to reach this goal state okay what are the actions that i can do here is the action i can do pick up i can do uh, put down i can do stack i can do unstack A stack means i can put x on y i can unstack means if x is on y so i can remove it so both i can do now <clears throat> come here the initial state and the goal state now how we can represent the initial state and how we can represent the goal state so with the help of a predicate logic or the first order logic so the initial state would be represented uh, here so we can write it here on a comma b so this this you understood a on b a on b yet yeah, is correct and and c on d right so this is my initial state and i have represented it with the help of a uh, predicate logic now the goal is state now in the goal state how we can represent it what it is written on table on table c c is on table right and on b is a is on b and d is on d right so this is what is there in the goal state now after representing the initial state and the goal state let's refer the goal state and try to understand this uh, algorithm so what is there in the algorithm what is the first step first step is post the original goal to the stack here i have a stack this is a stack now here in the stack i am going to put what i am going to put i am going to put the uh goal stack values here so the first value is on table c so table c is on table right so i'm just going to write here on table c c is on table this is my first right now what is the second second is on ab right so i'll write on a comma b what is the meaning of that a is top of b now the next one is on b comma d what is the meaning of that b is on d right so goal state or the predicate related to the goal i have written now there are some hidden predicates also 
or hidden uh, first order logic also like a is a box b is a box c is a box d is a box right that we know c is clear here a is clear right so we, we all these things we know we doesn't have to write it that is understood the uh, way of uh, representing the uh, goal stack so with this we can represent the goal stack now after putting after pushing the original goal into the goal stack what is the first step first step is is this if top is compound goal right this is my first condition if top is compound goal then pop it so dekho either you just uh, see here what is the top top is this on b comma d on b comma d you just refer the initial state what is the initial state initial state it here on b comma d hai kya is there any b comma d no there is no b comma d it means that it is not satisfied then we have to go to the second condition if top is a single unsatisfied goal yes it is single unsatisfied goal this is the unsatisfied goal so what we have to do then we have to replace it by action and push action preconditions so this we have to replace it with the help of uh, action and preconditions of the actions so so we'll start with what what is in top of it top of it is on b comma d is in the top now we just pop it and we just put the actions what are the actions so let's say i want to put what i want to do is i want to put uh, b on to b top of d it means what i have to do i have to stack so go to the rule r3 stack x b right x here is b y here is d so stack b d will do and what is the precondition here is holding x and clear y that we have to write so we'll write here 